In a world where water scarcity is becoming a global challenge, Atmospheric Water Generators or AWGs are offering a promising solution by literally pulling water from thin air. But what if we told you the key to making these devices efficient lies in something you can't even see, that is surface wettability. Wettability is simply how water behaves on a surface. It determines whether water spreads out or beads up into droplets. On hydrophilic surfaces, water loves to spread. On hydrophobic surfaces, water avoids contact and forms droplets. In an atmospheric water generator, this behavior directly affects how efficiently water can be harvested. This is because we don't want water to stay as a film on top of the condenser. If it does, then it would lead to other water molecules in the air to bypass the condenser as they are just unable to find a condensing surface leading to poor condensation efficiency. Ideally, we would want water to collect and run off. So if the condenser in the atmospheric water generator has hydrophilic surfaces, then it will lead to film condensation, which is efficient at collecting water, but slow to transfer heat. On the other hand, if the condenser is coated with hydrophobic material, then the weaker attraction between the surface and the water compared to water molecules attracted more to themselves aids the water to quickly turn into beads. This promotes dropwise condensation, allowing faster heat transfer and quicker water collection. Researchers are engineering surfaces with advanced coatings. Some are super hydrophobic to make water droplets slide off effortlessly. But using hydrophobic material alone does not help in controlling and channeling the flow. And for this reason, additional research is going in trying to mimic nature, like the Nemip desert beetle, which uses mixed wettability, that is to collect and transport water efficiently. If we examine closely the surface of a beetle shell, we observe that it consists of tiny hydrophilic bumps and hydrophobic troughs. The bumps help in collecting and nucleating the water. The troughs allow the water to run off. Recently, a super hydrophobic, super hydrophilic pattern fabric with copper enhanced conductivity mimicking the beetle's bumpy exoskeleton yielded an exceptionally high fog harvesting rate of 1432 milligrams per hour per centimeter square, making it feasible for industrial scale production. Even paints like Stokeler Dryonic have been developed using the same methodology of meshing hydrophobic and hydrophilic materials. This paint allows facades to dry quickly after rain, dew, or fog, leaving no time for algae or fungi to grow. But challenges remain. Coatings can wear out, surfaces can get dirty, and balancing condensation with water flow is a fine art. Yet with every innovation, we get closer to a future where clean, sustainable water is available even in the driest regions. Wettability may be invisible, but its impact is crystal clear. The size of surfaces is changing the way we harvest the most precious resource on Earth. Thank you for watching. Stay curious. Stay sustainable.